Welcome to the tutorial for Click Free for Mac Computers. This will show you how to use the software that's included with your Click Free Backup Genius. On the home screen of the app, there are three simple options. You can transfer all the files that are on your Click Free to your Mac. You can back up all the photos and videos that are on your Mac to the Click Free. Or you can choose specific files that are on your Mac and back them up to the Click Free Backup Genius. We're going to take these one at a time. And the first one we're going to choose is to transfer all files from Click Free to Mac. When we click Transfer All Files from Click Free to Mac, we're given the option to pick a folder where we'd like to place those files. We can browse and pick a specific folder of our choice, or just transfer. The default folder will be your Pictures folder under your username on your Mac. So if we select Open, that's the one where we'll transfer our pictures when we click Transfer. With this system, everything is being transferred from our Click Free to our Mac computer. I'm going to cancel this now, and it gives you the option to immediately view the files that you just transferred, or to view them at another time. If I click Yes, there I see the Click Free folder I just created. And within that folder is the backup. And within that folder, any backups you had on your Click Free, for example, a phone, it tells you whose phone, and there are all the different folders of photos dated. So it's easy to find exactly what you're looking for. Let's go back to Click Free. This time, we're going to back up all our photos and videos that are on our Mac onto the Click Free by clicking the middle option. And it starts immediately. Now you may get prompted to allow permission from your Mac to transfer these photos and videos to the Click Free. If it's your first time using it, you'll want to click Allow. Videos will take longer to transfer, photos will move more quickly. A full backup can take time, but you can cancel at any time. And when you go to do the backup the next time, it can pick up where you left off, eliminating duplicate files. So let's click Cancel. And when we do that, once again, it'll give us the option to view the files that we just saved. And that would be on the Click Free drive that we have connected to the Mac. There you see it. This time, let's not view those files. Let's keep going. Our last option is to pick select files from our computer to transfer to Click Free. When we do that, on the left side of the screen, we will see all of our various folders. And if we expand the folders, we'll see the files within them. We can pick entire folders to transfer or specific files. And all we have to do to transfer them is simply select the ones that we want to transfer and click the Add button in the middle of the screen. When you do that, you will see the files that you selected move from the left box over to the right box. And that indicates that they are ready to be transferred onto the click free. Once we've selected them, we simply click transfer and they're done. It's that simple. Three options. Transfer files from your click free drive to the Mac. Transfer photos and videos from your Mac to the click free. Or transfer select files like this onto the click free from your Mac. There's also help right on board the app where you can contact us if you need more support. It's just that simple to use your click-free desktop software for Mac to back up.